And a warm welcome. Our venue for this game is the Emirates Stadium in North London. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position. And alongside me is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player, Stuart Robson. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Arsenal facing Manchester City. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. And a look at the starting lineup for Arsenal. Aaron Ramsdale is the goalkeeper. Martin Odegaard plays alongside Thomas Partey in the centre of midfield. And the main striker here is Edward Nketia. And here's the Manchester City lineup. Ederson between the posts. Emerick Laporte plays with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Kevin De Bruyne plays with Jack Grealish in the wide positions. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. This game should offer plenty. Arsenal get it going. Martin Odegaard. Inside he goes. Superb block. Can he play it in? And the cross into the middle. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. <laughs> Playing it in. And the danger is still there. A textbook interception. Well, we have to say, Stuart, respect and admiration grows for Kevin De Bruyne with each passing year. So many attributes. What are you looking for from him in this game? Well, for me, Derek, his greatest attribute is his ability to combine with teammates, particularly in tight areas, in and around the box, clever little one-twos, little passes around the corner. He's the player that could be key to breaking down this defence. He's played us over to the near post. And in the end, no damage done. Nketia. Dangerous looking through ball. Well, here it is again. It's a wonderfully weighted ball over the top, and there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. Call for the City players, maybe. Can they find a response now? De Bruyne. Given away by City. White. Superb effort to keep it in. Ben White. Partey. 
Bad pass. And giving it away. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control. Oh, big opportunity! Just cleared away in the nick of time. Oh, he's gone for goal! Well, that's how to hit them. Not quite accurate enough, though. Well, what a goal that would have been. Surprised he took it on, to be honest. Long way out, but oh, so close. And under pressure, that was a fine claim. Fine work from City to win the ball back. And steered back under a bit of pressure. Grealish and scope for them to produce something exciting Rodri here's Bernardo Silva and will it be the leveller Bernardo Silva on target and has scored Well, here it is again, and credit to the goal scorer, but you have to ask questions of the keeper. He's got to have that near post covered for me. No wonder he's frustrated with himself. So the ball is running again at one all. The tackle completely missed time, and you would expect a booking under the circumstances. And a yellow card, it's going to be Stewart. Yeah, the ref's got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. could be in hot water here booked already and his race is run yeah he just lost his discipline there that's a really poor challenge he should have been taken off much earlier Xhaka too much elevation in terms of the shot. De Bruyne. Intelligent threaded pass here. Okay. Well read to put an end to that attack. Prepare to take on the shot. Well, tremendous block. And the pass could do damage. In position. Oh, it's a goal! Playing a man short doesn't seem to bother them. They hit the front. Well, as the replay shows us, Kevin De Bruyne picks out the pass to beat that defensive line. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. Oh, 
And they're playing once again. Manchester City with the advantage. White. And we're moving ever closer to half-time with Arsenal behind here. Stuart, interested to get your take as regards their first-half performance. Well, it's certainly been an open game with chances for both teams. But they must start winning some of those individual battles, particularly in the wide areas, if they're going to get anything out of this. Well, how close was that? Inches away. Bukayo Saka possession seeded by the Gunners and after that fantastic effort it's gone out for a throw in and getting in there to intercept on the scent of something positive and attempting the through ball oh a tremendous goal finessing it into the back of the net take a bow well here's the replay and just watch this it's clever it's skillful and it's effective that's a great goal Running again at two all. And Ketia can they get themselves in front here? Oh, and that is an audacious chip. Well, he might smile. The goalkeeper has no interest in smiling. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And the finish is sublime. He sees the keeper's position and just chips it over him. It's a breathtaking goal. Well, the game has been restarted. 3-2 here. Making progress. But the danger averted for now. Well, the action is going to continue for a while yet. We will have four minutes of stoppage time. Ake. Rodri. Here's Alvarez. Oh, couldn't quite find his teammate. Breaking at pace. Looked like an effective counter-attack, but brilliantly red. Ronaldo Silva. So half time, that will close the book on the first half here at the Emirates. Well, Riyad Mahrez, you've got to say, Stuart, there's no hiding it. Poor by his own standards. Well, I have to say he's not played well today. I'm a great fan of his, but he's looked way below his best here. Mind you, you could say that about the rest of the team as well. So the second half underway, and no doubt about it, City with work ahead of them. An effective challenge. De Bruyne.
and Kessia. Martinelli. Martinelli. And Kessia. A gift for any goalkeeper. Mares. Well, no let up, plenty of pressure. Great strong tackle, throw in forthcoming. A change in the offing for City. De Bruyne. On to Holland. Well, it could be on for him here. Oh, it's mischievous. And a goal! The equaliser! They simply refuse to be beaten. Down to ten men, but right back in this game. Well, that's a really cool finish. Just look how he lifts it beyond the goalkeeper. That's a great bit of skill. Another equaliser. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. And Kessia. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Rodri. Now Holland. Walker. Accurate pass upon accurate pass. Holland and a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Bernardo Silva. Really good diving save. Over it comes. Still not clear. Might be dangerous. Terrific block. Can he deliver it with accuracy? A strong goalkeeping after the corner had been delivered. Bernardo Silva. And still they wait for the chance. No way through. Ben White. Now Zinchenko. White. And here's Saliba. Ben White. Granite Jacka. Alexander Zinchenko. William Saliba. Threading it forward. And a promising looking attack, but comes to nothing in the end. Mares. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Crossing possibilities. What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. Substitution for Arsenal. Coming off the pitch. Number 14, Eddie Nketiah. Coming onto the pitch, number 19, Leandro Trossard. Alexander Zinchenko. It's with Gabriel. Now Zinchenko. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. Not to be this time. Twenty minutes to go. A City free kick forthcoming. And Manchester City will go to their bench. Manchester City coming off the pitch. Number 
26, Rian Mares, to be replaced by number 47, Phil Foden. De Bruyne. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Well, it petered out. Rodri. Walker. Can he finish? And a fine stop. Saka. Now in possession, Prosar. Lovely ball over the top. He just needs to keep a cool head. Well, the keeper is happy. The bar was there. Danger averted for now. Trossard. Well, Arsenal were so close to taking the lead. But if they keep making chances and play as they are doing, it's surely only a matter of time before they do so. Arsenal recovering possession well. And you don't want to lose possession there. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Bernardo Silva. Fantastic work to thwart the danger. Alexander Zinchenko. Martinelli. And with the teams locked together, Arsenal chasing and chasing that winner. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Rodri. De Bruyne now. Holland. Foden. Determined defending. Five minutes left. And a fine cross. Oh, can you believe it? With so little time left, surely that will be the winner. Amazing scenes here. Let's see this again, because the delivery into the box couldn't be any better. Played into just the right area, and it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. And the pass not quite accurate enough. And a throw in then. Substitution for Arsenal. Coming off the pitch, number 34, Granit. Martin Erdegaard. Onto the pitch, number 20. Alexander Zinchenko. Well, that's a well timed pass. And a goal! Here it is again. The through ball is absolutely inch perfect. And then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. Not a scoreline we see all that often. 5-3. And the referee has deemed that an additional four minutes are in order. 
Ronaldo Silva. And they have possession again. Partey. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Well, it fizzled out. Walker. And now it is official. The referee brings this match to an end and it's a victory for the Gunners. Well, Derek, it was a comfortable win in the end. Fully deserved their victory because they dominated every aspect of the game. It was a really good result for them here today. This performance in this particular game will have impressed many people, Stuart. Well, that was a great performance. His understanding of how to find space was brilliant today. And, of course, he scored two really good goals.